Well, with summer having just kicked off, it is a busy time for everyone as they're traveling, attending sporting events, maybe just chilling by the pool. And summer's also a critical time for Impact Life Blood Center. The need is great for blood donors. That's why WCIA 3 has teamed up with Impact Life for a blood drive in honor of Dave Benton and Robert Reese. Terry McCarthy joins us with more. Terry, so glad to have you here with so us. So glad to be here. And I know that we're gearing up for a blood drive that's happening here next week. Yes. Tell us about this blood drive. The blood drive is the WCIA gift of life in honor of Dave Benton and Robert Reese, who are two people who used to work for WCIA and very beloved anchors. And we decided a few years back that we needed to do a blood drive in their honor. Both of them are cancer, they had cancer. Both of them had blood donors and blood recipients. And that's kind of your number one um, outlet where you're sending your blood to is, is people fighting cancer. Is that right? That is correct. Almost 18% of our blood goes to people who are battling cancer. And I don't know anyone who doesn't know someone oh. who is in that fight. Absolutely. Gosh. Like Eleanor. Tell me about Eleanor. Eleanor is my friend Becca's granddaughter. And Eleanor, before she was one years old, was diagnosed with a childhood cancer. And she was one of the people who was a blood recipient. And as you can see, this is Eleanor at a very, very young age. Look at that. Oh, well, my doll baby. A cute month <laughs> kid. And this is right after she had received blood. She had received many blood products that helped her through her cancer journey. And I am very, oh, very happy wow. to say this is Eleanor today. Hula hoop and Hula everything. Oh. Absolutely. And that's the difference blood and life saving blood products can make in the life of anybody with cancer or in a car accident. It is blood is medicine. Yeah. We forget that. And the most important thing for me moving forward is to put a face to that. And Eleanor was that face for me for a long time and continues to be. When I needed to ask people if they would continue to donate blood, especially at times like this summer when the need is so dire, it motivated me because it is personal to someone. It's always personal to someone, just like it was for Robert Reese, Dave Benton, and Eleanor. Why do you think the donations go down in the summer? Well, the number one reason is because we don't have access to high school and college students. Mm -hmm. And almost 20% of our donor base comes from those groups. And then there are people traveling and doing all the things that they do in summer. So they're, they're not on such a set schedule. So they might be traveling, doing things like that, things that they forget that we still need to have a safe and adequate blood supply. And who can give blood? Well, you have to be at least 16 years old and with par parental permission at 16, 17 on your own, but almost anyone. We have this resource within us. Anybody who is healthy can do this. And anybody who's not healthy knows how important it is to have other people donate. Let's talk about what the day looks like when if when you sign up for yes. your time slot because mm -hmm. um, it's going to be right here in our back parking lot exactly what does this process look like from like start to finish from start to finish we ask that people have an hour to dedicate to the process that's not all donating blood that whole hour the actual do blood donation process usually takes about 10 to 12 minutes but when you start you sign up online you go you sign up for your appointment you show up you're feeling good you're wearing a mask, you're well hydrated, you have eaten a meal prior to coming there, we get you registered, you answer a series of questions. How are you feeling today? Have you traveled to these different places? Following that, we do a little mini physical. So we're checking your blood pressure, different things like that, that you would at a normal doctor's appointment. And that takes the most time. Once you go through all of those things, when we're checking your iron levels, et cetera, and if you're good to go on that end, we send you to donate blood. And again, that's 10 to 12 minutes. And following that, for at least another 10 minutes, you are obligated to sit down and eat cookies and <laughs> all sorts of good things. Well, that sounds like so much fun. Yeah. Your cookies worse things, <laughs> yeah, I guess. It would be. But you know, one of the things I neglected to mention is that we do have incentives. And next week, because we are going into the most challenging week of the year, because we are in such dire need of blood, that we are going to be offering 
an incentive of a $20 gift card to anyone who comes to a donor center or comes to the WCIA Gift of Life blood drive. We'll give you a voucher for that, and that voucher is good for anywhere from Amazon to Target wow, and a, wow. a variety of different places. So pretty much it's like having money in your pocket to do that, feeling good, and your donation will save up to three lives right here in our own community. Wow. Wonderful. Okay, we're looking at the screen here. It is on Thursday um, from 9 to 4. You mentioned signing up online. We will have that website available at CILiving.tv. If they cannot make it Thursday, though, they can still donate in honor of Dave and Eleanor and, and Robert. They just have to mention WCIA3, is that right? Absolutely, that's okay. exactly right. Just go into one of the donor centers closest to you, whether that's in Urbana, Danville, Springfield, Decatur, or Mattoon, and say WCIA3 and it will be credited to this drive. Wonderful, well go. we wanna have the most blood given <laughs> ever on Thursday. We appreciate the work you're doing. Oh, thank you. And we're so happy that Eleanor looks so happy yes, there. Yes, and healthy, so good. We're All right, gonna invite Eleanor for a hula hoop concert. Ooh. Oh, okay, come on out, Eleanor. <laughs> Sounds like lots of fun. All right, well, there's a look at, of course, the website where you can learn more. Come join us Thursday. And there's we're going to connect you with that over on our website, cialiving.tv.